time now for Eyewitness News Call 12 for Action. Well, when it comes to running the latest trend, less is more, less shoe, that is. Susan Hogan has more on that. When you think of running, you think of putting on your sneakers, right? Well, the new trend is barefoot running, and it's catching on. When Preston Curtis gets ready to run, there's one thing he doesn't do lace up his shoes. When I run barefoot, my feet feel really good. They actually feel like they're getting a massage. Preston is one of a growing group of runners pounding the pavement without the support of traditional running sneakers. Jeff Degnett with Runner's World Magazine says the sport has a loud and passionate following. The idea behind it is it's the way we were sort of born to run. It's a natural way of running. Some runners choose to go completely barefoot while others slip on those so-called minimalist shoes. The truly minimalist or barefoot-like shoes are nothing more than a layer for abrasion resistance and something to hold it onto your foot. The American Academy of Orthopedic Surgeons says ditching the extra cushioning causes most runners to switch up their step. Typically the barefoot runner lands with the front of the foot or the middle of the foot hitting the ground first, whereas the runner with shoes on will strike the ground with their heel first. Many runners, including Preston, believes barefoot running actually helps prevent injury, even though they're exposed to problems other runners don't face. In fact, she treats one to five barefoot runners a week. The most common injury I see in a barefoot runner is a stress fracture or a tendon problem that occur typically when the uh, patient is transitioning from shoe wear to no shoe wear. So if you'd like to kick off your shoes, don't hit the ground running. Ease into the style slowly. The transition to running barefoot or to running in minimal shoes can take weeks or months or even a year. Preston started with a walk around the neighborhood and hasn't looked back. You feel like you're completely whole with your body and you're, you're, everything's moving perfectly. Now there are a lot of barefoot clinics out there right now to teach you how to actually run properly with your bare feet. But before you actually sign up, make sure they're certified. And if you have a consumer problem you need help solving, contact our Call 12 for Action Center Monday through Thursday from 11 until 1, hotline 228-1850. I'm Problem Solver Susan Hogan, Eyewitness News.